YouTube, what's the vibe? Global CZ back in here, you feel me? Today, we're going to speak on a topic. This topic is overseas women, you feel me? Coming from wherever you coming from, bro. Traveling and you running into women. You're going to have a lot of good times. You're going to have a lot of ease with certain shit. Making conversation is like this. Getting dates is like this. Depends where you are, though, and who you are. Getting noticed by women is so fucking easy. But I'm going to explain the bad parts of this shit, the downsides of this shit, you feel me? The shit that catches you off guard. So we all know going overseas, you feel me, going to new places, new countries where they don't see you as much, you're going to stick out like a sore thumb. Girls is always going to be looking at you, triple taking, you feel me? Especially if you dress a certain way, you look a certain way, you have different features and stuff like that, or a different accent. Girls is going to be on your body, bro. These girls going to be on your body, bro, in person. I don't know if y'all use Tinder or whatever like that. I'm really, a, I like to be in person, you feel me? Let the girls come to me wherever I'm at. Feel me? And that's anywhere I go, bro. Just go outside. I just be me and I observe. You feel me? See what the girl's temperature is. Anywhere I go, I just observe. Read people's energy and read people's like body movement and language and stuff like that. Y'all already know I already talk about this shit. You go to certain places, bro, you're like a fucking celebrity. Bro, I've had girls scream when they see me, bro. Chase me down the street, all type of shit. I'll say that's mostly like the UK and Thailand, bro. UK and Thailand. The girls just know off the bat, like, what's up? They know exactly what type of nigga I am, and they like it, you feel me? But, hey, one thing about this shit, bro, when you overseas, you never know why these girls actually fucking like you. You never know what they see in you, bro. Besides my skin color, you feel me? Besides my accent, besides how I dress, besides my energy, why does she like me? And that's with any girl, bro. I, I always wonder that. I might not ask it, but I'm always paying attention. I'm always wondering in the back of my head, bro. I never... Just assume I'm that guy, you feel me? Unless a girl is part of your tribe. If you know what a tribe is, it's like the main spectrum of girls that usually are attracted to you off the bat. You feel me? I know my tribe, so I know which females are going to like me just off the walk-in. I know which females usually don't go for a guy like me, you feel me? I'm not stupid. I'm not delusional. Which a lot of guys are, you feel me? A lot of guys are blinded by beauty and lust. Obviously, I know certain girls would never fuck with guys like me, so I wouldn't carry that on. And if I'm communicating with them, I wouldn't like try to go over and beyond, you feel me? I keep it at a, a general acquaintance level. But a lot of times going overseas, you're running into different types of women. A lot of women are gonna be the same as any other place, but you're running into different type of women, different qualities. And some of these women have never even talked to a black guy. Some of these women never talked to a foreigner. Some of these women never talked to an American. So that could be a little confusing because like you don't really know why she likes you. You don't really know what to, you feel me? You don't really know what she likes. So one thing that happens a lot with a lot of guys will be sexually attracted to him at first. And then we'll try to like put that to the side and then try to see more of this woman. You feel me? This happens to a lot of guys. You feel me? I talk to a lot of people and I've seen it a lot. And this is not just an overseas thing. This happens everywhere. A lot of guys will put our sexual nature to the side and try to like get to know this woman and treat her more than what the situation is at hand. You feel me? Think that she wants more from you. Think it's going somewhere. You feel me? Think she wants to see this side of you. Think she wants to hear this from you. Think she wants you to do this for her. And in reality, she just wanted to have sex with you for one night. And then you're wondering where the fuck she went. Why the fuck she left you. Why the fuck she didn't want to take it serious. You feel me? You already overplayed your part and shit like that. So you feel stupid. You feel like you put yourself out there and shit like that. And then when you start thinking in hindsight, damn, she never really did like me. You feel me? She only wanted to fuck. But she was looking at her as something else. You thought she was a good girl type shit. Not saying she's a bad person, but a lot of dudes... Sometimes we do that shit, bro, where we think it's too good to be true and we got to do this to keep this woman do that. And really, she just wanted to fuck you maybe because of your physical attributes, maybe because you're something different, maybe because you were a fetish to her, but she doesn't see you as anything more than that and nothing serious. You feel me? A lot of dudes be heartbroken out there, bro. I've never been heartbroken, but like sometimes like you be running through bitches. You feel me? That actually wants you, but you, you don't want nothing more from it. Then another girl comes along, might have been a little bit shyer. You feel me? And then you try to overplay that part. And then you feel played because she didn't want more from you. All she wanted was sex. All she wanted was to hang out or some shit like that, bro. And then you wonder why the fuck she ain't calling back. Why the fuck she ain't, you feel me? And then you think back, oh, the way I met this bitch was on some sexual shit. The way I met this bitch was on some lustful shit. The way I met her was on some Tinder shit, you feel me? So it's like, that can happen a lot. And a lot of dudes, y'all make y'all self stale. Like, y'all thin y'all self out so much. To where the girl no longer respects you as like a... Basically, you make yourself look easy, you feel me? Basically, you make yourself look like 
thirsty, like you have no other option. Were you taking her too serious and maybe she has a other boyfriend, maybe she has a whole other life where she don't want to get into a relationship and push further and she know it's not going to go nowhere, you feel me? Because you are a foreigner, bro. Maybe you're a tourist, so it's like she got her head on straight. She knows what she's coming into this for, but you, on the other hand, you want more out of it. And obviously there's instances where a girl wants money, a girl wants to experience from you. We already know that, but that really don't happen to me because like I'm a young dude. And girls already know what comes with young dudes. They're not expecting money and monetary gain out of us. So when that conversation comes up, I never really talk about it because that's not something I'm experienced with. And the way I present myself as a man, I never present myself with flash. I'm never the loudest in the room, monetary wise, you feel me? That's not really a problem I can speak on. But I do see it happen a lot. A dude will come out and then start, start leading with his wallet, start paying for shit, buying the girl drinks and all this shit. And then the girl's being nice to him because he's doing this, but he thinks that it's more than that. And he thinks that she owes him something at the end of the day. And dudes realize, damn, obviously she's not gonna say no to me buying her shit and paying for shit. At the end of the day, she don't see you as like a partner. She don't see you as somebody that she's sexually attracted to. So that happens a lot to a lot of dudes. When I travel, I'm around a lot of older dudes. I see that often. And a lot of dudes gotta realize, bro, just cause you in another country, just cause these women might have a different type of values and whatever, women are still women, bro. Women are still biologically trained to be like women you feel me at the end of the day so like if you're overplaying your part and shit like that and you're overdoing it bro she might naturally step back from that she don't know why you're doing this shit she know you faking it bro she know you're just trying to get something out of her or she know you thirsty or she might know it's not going nowhere bro there's instances where girls will come just want to fuck you bro and then after that, you start liking her like, damn, she chill, she cool, you feel me? The sex was all right, but she's gone, bro. She might have a man, bro. She might have been guilty that whole time cheating on her man with something new, something exciting. You thinking, oh, this is my girl now, you feel me? She might be, you feel me? But bro, that's not your girl. That's reality, bro. Or there's instances where you think this is your girl, but you don't know she's a fucking hoe. She might be a good woman, you feel me? But she's still a hoe. She still got other guys, you feel me? You're not the only one. She might do this shit, you feel me? You might just be her fucking type, you feel me? And she had to go fuck you. That happens, bro, that happens a lot everywhere, bro. A dude will think he's that guy. Bro, you're just her type. You're just her type. You just turned her on sexually, bro. But after that, that's it, you feel me? Nothing more. And I realized that in Thailand when I was traveling, bro, because a lot of these girls will come up to you and pour their heart out to you and shit. Like, you don't even know me. You feel me? You just know what I look like. You'll just be their type. And then when y'all together and shit, you realize you don't relate to this female, bro. Like, this female annoys the fuck out you. This female don't understand you mentally. Like, she don't understand why you do what you do. She don't understand where you're coming from. When y'all talk, there's no, like, common ground. That can happen a lot with language barriers, too. When y'all talk, there's no common ground. Y'all have nothing in common. My trick with women, bro, I play music around them. If they can't vibe with my music, if they can't dance, you feel me? This is also how I get them turned on and shit like that, bro. I start dancing with them, play some music. If they can't vibe with that, that's the automatic turn off. I, I, I know what type of girl that is, you feel me? If we don't have the same taste in music, she don't got no rhythm, I know what time it is, you feel me? This shit comes with experience over time of learning woman, you feel me? Depending on the place you're at. Every place you go, you're gonna have to learn the woman again. You feel me? And it takes a little while, so. And another thing, this is the biggest thing that happens to me. You feel me? When I'm overseas, this happens a lot in like the UK. I spent the most time in the UK, so this is why I, I always revert back to the UK. The UK, bro, a lot of these women will only be around you for attention. You feel me? They'll see the amount of attention you have, like that you gain in public. You feel me? It just everywhere you go, people are always looking at you. You have the light. You feel me? You're different. You look different. You carry yourself different. You walk with a different energy. You know, just try to be around that, bro. They'll throw themselves at you, do all this shit, but they don't really fucking like you, bro. That's one thing I realized early. They don't like you, bro. A lot of these women don't like you. Even anywhere you go, a lot of places, bro. Anywhere you go, that women do this, bro. They'll see the guy with the most attention, you feel me? Not the guy that's doing the most. The guy who gets the most attention naturally. I'm usually the quietest man in the room. You feel me? Observing. Girls that try to just be around you, bro. I watched everything, bro. Listen to me, bro. And anybody that know me know I watch everything. I'm never doing the most. I'm always chilling, you feel me? Especially in like a public setting 
or a club or some shit. And I just watch how women just gravitate towards me, bro. They just want my attention, you feel me? They don't really like me. I know when a woman really like me, bro. And I know certain women, they be bad as shit, but they ain't getting no attention. And they just come around me for that attention. They want to be seen next to me. And I know this happens to a lot of dudes. And a lot of dudes probably don't know why the fuck this happens. They think, oh, bitches just like me. Bitches on my dick. Nah. Bitches want your light. Bitches want to be seen next to the guy that's popping or looks like he's popping. You feel me? If you wasn't that guy, bro. If you wasn't different. If you wasn't standing out, she would not fuck with you. And a lot of girls, they'll throw themselves at you. Do the most. You feel me? Come on to you sexually. And then when you actually try to do something, they, they won't be with it. You feel me? It's like they literally just want to see you want them and then they get fulfillment out of that like they don't want anything else from you you feel me but if you act like you don't want them if you just mind your business and then treat them like regular humans it's like they'll like you more bro and they'll start like actually liking you most of the times that shit is an act they just want validation from you. that's the word validation they want your validation because they know it's important they know you attract women so they want to be one of them bro but they don't want you to like actually conquer them if you know what I'm saying. Bro, women are our man's enemy. You feel me? No matter where you are, the women are still your enemy. Just because they might be nicer, they might be cuter, they're still your enemy, bro. They still want to conquer you. So it's like once they got you, they know what type of guy you are. Okay, he's easy. You feel me? Okay. He falls for beauty. Okay. This is what gets him. You feel me? So you never want to like show your hand in that type of shit. You feel me? You always want to play it cool. And this drives women crazy, bro. Women always tell me I, I drive them crazy because they don't know what I want. I'm nonchalant. And that's just how I am, bro. And that's just how I've always been. You feel me? Even with family, bro. Family will say the same shit. Like, they can't figure me out. Because it's war. This is war, bro. This is combat. People only want to break you down so they can get one over on you and feel more powerful than you, bro. And this is the same shit with women. Women do it even more. A lot of men do that shit, too. They'll try to see what's your weakness and shit. See what, like, gets you to open up and shit like that. A lot of people will try to give me drinks. A lot of people will try to see what my vice is and shit like that. So I can let my guard down, bro. Because they know I'm observing them and I'm watching them. You feel me? To see if they slip up. To see if they faking it, bro. You feel me? And people hate that shit. But I love that shit. You gotta come a hundred with me, bro. A lot of people in this fucking world fake it, bro. And I force people to keep it a hundred. I force people to keep it a hundred, bro. That's all I want out of people. You feel me? I don't want to manipulate nobody. I just want to see the real you, and I'll treat you accordingly. But, hey, what was CZ, man? That's some real shit. That's some real game for y'all. A lot of people won't understand this because a lot of people just, I'm going to be honest, a lot of y'all just leave with y'all wallet. So all this other shit don't come into play with y'all, you feel me? A lot of y'all don't see women on an intellectual level. A lot of y'all don't really have these interactions. A lot of y'all is just get drunk, crash the fuck out, you feel me? I can't relate with y'all. But, hey, global CZ, we out this bitch. <laughs> Came up out of dirty part, man. How the fuck I made it out the friends? I don't do no wifey, don't do friends.